Brady Sitwinski, New Lenox, Illinois. Brad Miller, Kansas City, Missouri. Connor Drum, Long Island, New York. DJ Parks, St. Louis, Missouri. Brian Castle, Ventura, California.
so you guys bowled 995. You were getting your feet wet a little bit. Uh, Eddie, the, the first game, you had a few gutter balls, right? <laughs> Bring that up now on camera? I, I think we got a few gutter balls. I think he yeah, had, I fouled yeah, twice. Yeah, I think he had a foul, too. I fouled twice, and like after one of the fouls, the ball went off my hand completely. Like, super nervous. I don't know why. Okay, but then the second game, you guys really locked it in. You guys were able to shoot a world record score tonight. Eddie, let's talk a little bit about the line you were playing. You were in deep for a left-hander, which is unusual. Tell us why you decided to play there, and kind of a little bit about that, that game that you bowled. Uh, just let the ball do the work. Um, just where everybody wasn't playing, where nobody expects a lefty to play. If there's any lefties, I'm away from them, so I don't have to worry about their breakdown. I just throw my game and play in my line. That's all I do. And Brad, uh, you normally bowl fifth on this team, but tonight yeah, you, decided, Brad. You, decided to bowl, you decided to bowl fourth. Was there any strategic planning with bowling fourth tonight? Or? Nah, no, no. Sometimes we're on a rotation. Actually, okay. most of the weeks we're on a rotation. And so just because we, we mark down every frame, like we get hung and stuff, and usually the anchor has like the worst end of that, so we okay. get fair bank orders for every time you know, we get marked and stuff. Can you talk a little about what was going through your mind when all you stepped I, up in the 10th frame? All I wanted to do was give Council a shot to 9 spare. Because 9 spare strike, we still get the record, you know? The right. thing I was thinking of is just don't make Council have to get the record. Just make it easy on and now Connor here, Connor had some success earlier in the season by opening up with the front, how many did you have? Front 24. Front 24, he goes 300, 300 to start the year here oh boy. Um, in about week five or six or so, I believe it was. And what did you have that night, what did you shoot the last game? Uh, 242. Okay, 242, so you had 842 earlier in the season. So you, you've had a lot of success here for bowling leadoff tonight, and you were able to set the pace. What did it feel like tonight as opposed to the night you had 842 with the first two 300s? It was much bigger tonight than it was the 42. To lead off for a team to shoot a world record is much more important than any individual score ever. What kind of emotion was going through your mind once you had the record? Well, to be honest with you, like, uh, I didn't even know how many I needed for the record. <coughs> so I hit the first one and just literally just took as many deep breaths as I could. And I hit the first one and I thought that was it. I thought we were done. And, like we, I had a little bit of tears going on my eye, and then just everyone just started going nuts, and it was a, it was probably the best feeling of my life. Like the third one meant absolutely nothing to me. Like and everyone kept telling me like it was done, it was done, it was done. Like oh yeah, one more for 300, it meant absolutely nothing. Like I pretty much threw the third one straight down lane as hard as I could. To, to get at least seven. Like, I didn't really care. <laughs> I know you guys have, have, have a roster and everything, but do uh, you think this new lineup, whenever you five bowl together, is going to be solidified? Oh, this it's is, done. This is this the is new lineup right? all the time? Or? All right. it, it doesn't matter what we even do beyond this time. Like, we set a world record, and, I mean, this is a once-in-a-lifetime thing that's ever happened. Like, like, it doesn't matter how many doubles that we throw in the 10th, like, this is the double in the 10th that's going to mean the most. Like, at least for me. I don't know what they think, but this is the double in the 10th that's going to mean the most to doesn't me. get it better. All right, so and and that, that, that's what's amazing to me. All right, so the last question I'm going to throw over to EJ here. Um, you guys, you've got an 842 with two 300s to start off the season. Then you've, EJ, what, what's next for you guys? I mean, what can you possibly do next? I don't know. <laughs> and, unless we unless we do this again, which I doubt will happen, I don't know. Catch the gingers. 1435. Yeah. No. 1435. Nothing, that's what's next. Nothing's, nothing's going exactly. to compare. Nothing's going to compare to this unless we do it again. Because this is like once in a lifetime that. All right, guys. Well, congratulations Thank on behalf you. of the whole league <laughs> and all of us, man. Great bowling. And uh, congratulations. All right, guys. Thanks.